What is up YouTube back for another video today we are going to be uh, doing some wood cleaning so I think this will be the first time on the channel that I showed you guys some wood cleaning and honestly that's because I'm not the biggest fan of cleaning wood at all but we're gonna be doing I'm um, getting this uh, deck looking nice and good for a repeat customer and I'm gonna show you guys the deck right now all right guys so here's the deck that we'll be cleaning today you guys can see it is pretty darn dirty so i'm excited about this one because we're going to get it looking spiffy again spiffy and spectacular you feel me all right so if you've seen a couple videos ago i showed you guys a new chemical that um one of the um reps at one of the uh stores i should um get supplies from he recommended this new chemical so i'll be trying that on the deck so actually we're gonna be doing a bit pretty much a three-step process one we're going to uh we're gonna apply obviously sodium hypochlorite. We're gonna rinse the deck off first, get off the debris. And then we're gonna be um, using sodium hypochlorite to you know clean, kill the, the mold and mildew, whatever. Um, I'm use my soft wash machine to apply it. Two, we're gonna try out the chemical, and I'll show you guys that again in a second. And then three, once we've cleaned the deck, we're gonna pretty much once it's all the way clean, we're gonna apply some oxalic acid to it as a uh, brightener, wood brightener. So yeah, it's gonna be looking pretty good. Like I said, I normally don't do a whole lot of wood jobs because it's not my favorite. But, um, you know, I figured it'd be helpful to kind of show you guys some wood cleaning. And hopefully it turns out well or else this video won't make it on YouTube. If it does, that means if the deck came out well. Anyway, guys, let me go ahead and uh, unpack and get ready to get started. All right, guys, so here's the chemical that I talked about, new again. And you can see for wood, so yeah, we'll see how it comes out. All right guys, so the first thing we wanna do with this deck, we're gonna clear it off the debris. So um, I'm using this push broom, but I could easily just use my pressure washer to blow it off. So number one, clear the deck off. Key things to remember when washing the deck is don't get too close to the deck with the uh, nozzle. And also don't use too much pressure because what you're gonna start to do, you're gonna start to splinter the wood if you get too close, especially uh, messing with you know older wood like this. You wanna be gentle with it. So we're gonna go take more of like a low pressure approach with the deck um, in a sense. Um, like I said, so past that, that's one of the biggest things you wanna remember. Don't get too close. If you can, go with the grain. Using a surface cleaner on the deck, eh, I've done it before and had good results. You just wanna be careful not to, I'm gonna say for the sake of the video, don't use surface cleaner because I feel like for most people, you don't have any experience, you could tear up a deck. Um, so we're gonna stay away from surface cleaners for now. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna just finish uh, cleaning this deck off and we'll get started with the process. All right, guys, so normally we want to be careful about vegetation with spraying a mix like this, but luckily for us, there really is no vegetation around. You guys can see it's dirt. So before you guys comment like, oh, plants and stuff, there is no vegetation over here. So we're good to go as far as spraying the mix we're spraying right now. Anyway, let's continue.
Yeah, so what I'm doing right now is I'm X-jetting the uh, second chemical onto the deck. Now, I'll be honest, I don't have my measuring cup today. And I also am just eyeballing it first time using it. So we don't, I don't really know if the ratio is correct right now and I'm X-jetting it. So it means it's being diluted by the X-jet. So we could, we might not see the greatest result with this. And I won't be able to fully tell how good it is because this is coming after I've already applied sodium hypochlorite. So, end of the day, we're really paying attention to what is the end result of the deck. But I just wanted to let you guys know that's what's going on right now. I'm applying the second chemical through X-Jet method. So, let me continue. Alright guys, so now what I'm doing is I'm playing a little bit of a waiting game. So we apply the chemical, you do want to give it some dwell time. So we're going to let it sit for about 10-15 minutes just so it can, um, you know, kind of do its thing. While I'm waiting though, I am rinsing out my pump. Guys, rinse out your pumps. If you do not rinse out your pump every single time, it will go to crap. These pumps, like bleach we know is corrosive. It will, a lot of guys go through their pumps like in a couple months. And they're like, oh, my pump went out. But they're not rinsing it every time. Once you use your pump, once you're done using it, every single job, rinse it out with at least, I would say probably at 10 gallons of water. Clear out the system, flush it out. If you do not do that, it will not last. I've had my pump now, the same pump, for not a year yet, but a decent amount of time uh, compared to some guys I've seen go through pumps very quickly. So my pump has lasted because I do, in fact, rinse it every single time. So I'm drilling that in your head. Alright guys, so when you're rinsing, one of the things that can happen if you like get too close um, is you could be like uh, kind of like the wine marks uh, on the wood. Now on this deck, she is painting this deck, so if I if that does happen, so basically I don't have to be as tedious in the process of washing um, because it's getting painted. So if there are any marks, it will be covered. But I just want to note that, guys.
the cool blue light. Like the cool blue light. guys here's the final product it is still wet but the last thing I did was I applied um, oxalic acid and I, I did use them um, I actually it on here and you can see the wood is already brighter and as it dries it's gonna look even brighter so what's gonna happen is I'm probably gonna swing back by here after my last job just to get an after picture so I can show you guys what it looks like um, completely dry obviously it's gonna definitely look lighter than this um, but we want to see the finished completed result but this is what we have guys this is how you uh wash a deck and i'm not the best wood cleaner so um by no means am i a wood expert someone probably could do even better than this but this is what i got so and the customer is very happy and like i said she will be painting this so at the end of the day the really what the goal is for this deck is to be clean uh, it doesn't have to be perfect looking per se because like i said she is replacing some of these panels um as well as painting the deck so you want to be able to see any of the mistakes or stuff stuff like that anyway guys let me go ahead and finish packing up. All right, guys, I'll show you guys some bonus footage. I actually came back to the customer's house a few hours uh, later to see the deck dry. Guys, here we go. I'm excited to show you guys the finished product in three, two, one. All right, guys, so here is the finished product. I mean, guys, y'all seen, I'll put up another picture of the before, but you guys seen what the deck looked like. This looks like a whole different deck. Like, and this is what the oxalic did. As it dried, you guys seen that it helped brighten up the wood, right? So, little tip there, when you, um, you know, once you're done washing a deck, if it's a uh, untreated deck or unpainted, you can apply the oxalic acid to the wood, and this is the results you get. And I'm honestly really proud of myself because I really don't mess with wood that much, but I mean, like, the customer, she was ecstatic. She was telling me how great it looked, and I didn't believe it at first, so I came back here and see it myself. And from what it was to what it is now, I must say, I did a very good job. So that got so uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so there you guys go. Finish. This is how you clean the deck. All right, guys. See you next week. All right, guys. Thank you for watching this video. Don't, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. As always, leave a comment, a like, a dislike, whatever. Tell me what you thought of this video. Um, give me some tips. If you're a wood expert, help me out. You know some things I can do to improve my results. But anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Peace out.